Hannah Glass, nay Allgood, March 1708 to the 1st of September 1770, was an English cookery writer of the 18th century. She is remembered mainly for her best-selling cookbook, The Art of Cookery Made Plain and Easy, first published in 1747. The book was reprinted within its first year of publication, appeared in 20 editions in the 18th century, and continued to be published until 1846. Early life Glass was christened on 24 March 1708 at St. Andrews, Holborn, London. Her father was Isaac Allgood, a landowner of Brandon and Simonburn, both in Northumberland. He married Hannah Clark, the daughter of a London vintner. Hannah Glass once described her mother in a letter as being a wicked wretch. On 5 August 1724, at Leyden, Hannah Glass married an Irish soldier, John Glass. Glass S. Letters reveal that from 1728 to 32 the couple held positions in the household of the 4th Earl of Donegal at Broomfield, Essex. Thereafter, it seems, they lived in London. Glass's identity as the author of one of the most popular of 18th century cookery books was confirmed in 1938 by the historian Madeline Hope Dodds. The Art of Cookery Made Plain and Easy was published by subscription in 1747, and also sold at Mrs. Ashburn's, a china shop, the corner of Fleet Ditch. According to the title page, a second edition appeared before the year was out. The book did not reveal its authorship, using the vague cover, by a lady. This permitted the erroneous claim that it was written by John Hill, for instance in James Boswell. S. Life of Johnson. Johnson was not convinced. In 1747, the same year in which the book appeared, John Glass died. Also in that year, Glass set herself up as a habitmaker, or dressmaker in Tavistock Street, Covent Garden, in partnership with her eldest daughter, Margaret. Later years In 1754, Glass was bankrupted. Her stock was not auctioned after the bankruptcy, as it was all held in Margaret. S name. However, on the 29th of October 1754, she was forced to auction her most prized asset, the copyright for the art of cookery. On the 17th of December 1754, the London Gazette stated that Glass would be discharged from bankruptcy on the 11th of January 1755. Later that same year, she and her brother Lancelot repaid the sum of £500 they had jointly borrowed from Sir Henry Bedingfeld two years before. Her daughter paid the rates on the Tavistock premises for 1757, but the property was listed as empty next year, as Glass had again fallen into financial difficulties and was consigned on the 22nd of June 1757 to the Marshalsea debtors. Prison. In July 1757, she was transferred to Fleet Prison. No record has been found of her release date, but she was a free woman by 2 December 1757, as on this day she registered three shares in the Servants' Directory, a new book she had written on the managing of a household. It was not a commercially successful venture, although its plagiarized editions were popular in North America. In 1755, Anne Cook published Professed Cookery, containing a 68-page attack on glass. Cook lived in Hexham, and was reacting to an alleged campaign of intimidation and persecution by Lancelot Allgood. In the same year, Glass published her third and last work, The Complete Confectioner. It was reprinted several times, but did not match the success that she had enjoyed with the art of cookery. Family Glass and her husband had either 10 or 11 children. Death The London Gazette announced that, "...Mrs. Hannah Glass, half-sister to Lancelot Allgood, died on 1 September 1770, aged 62." Legacy The instruction First catch your hair," is sometimes misattributed to Glass. The closest to it in her art of cookery is the recipe for roast hair page 6 which begins, "...take your hair when it be cast." 
meaning simply to take a skinned hair. This is likely to be the origin of the popular saying. In 1994, Prospect Books published a facsimile of the 1747 edition of Art of Cookery under the title First Catch Your Hair, with introductory essays by Jennifer Stead and Priscilla Bain, and a glossary by Alan Davidson. It was reissued in paperback in 2004. In 1998, Applewood Books published a facsimile edition of the 1805 edition, annotated by culinary historian Karen Hess. In 2006, Glass was the subject of a BBC drama documentary that called her the "...mother of the modern dinner party," and "...the first domestic goddess." Walter Stibe serves Glass S recipes in the City Tavern, Philadelphia, and praises her in his colonial cookbooks and his television show, A Taste of History, the 310th anniversary of Hannah Glass's birthday was the subject of a Google Doodle on 28 March 2018. Notes References External links Extract of Art of Cookery", from the British Library, and Biographical Information. Notes and excerpts from the text. Complete version of the Art of Cookery at Foods of England. City Tavern website. Works by Hannah Glass at LibriVox, public domain audiobooks.